we've learned a, a huge amount about the biology of senescence. We have understood what it is, we have understood how important it is in, in biology. And what is important now is to bring that knowledge to people, to patients. Uh, myself, I'm working on a tumor-induced premature aging, aging that is faster than it needs to be. And we know that in animals we can rescue that with uh, anti-senescence interventions. Now we need to go into people. Now we need to see, does it help people to live not just longer, but for longer in good health, with good capabilities, with the ability to enjoy their lives. And I think it's possible. We are starting to do that. And I do foresee that in a few years, we will know whether it works in people. And if it does, then that should really change the way how we today think about aging and age-related functional decline and age-related diseases.